my research is actually on teaching chemistry through alternative media, which is graphic novels. What we do is we take a basic chemistry concept, like one of our recent stories is about the energy of a reaction and how a catalyst can change that. We have four adventurers who are trying to find treasure to make their life better, basically saying that at the end of the reaction, they would have a lower energy state. But along the way, they have to climb a mountain and they encounter a dragon, which reflects the energy of transition, which is higher. And they're unable to get past that dragon, so they actually can't reach, the reaction can't finish. They can't reach the low reaction state. But then a nice old man comes and they shows him a, a secret pathway through the mountain to uh, reflect what a catalyst does, which is to open up a separate path. I think that it's really important for us to be able to teach chemistry in a way that's entertaining. I think that a lot of science gets lost in just scientific jargon and we lose what makes science so exciting and what makes it so relatable, which is the fact that the concepts are things that we can understand in our day-to-day -day life. Please like us on Facebook and check out our graphic novels at coworkersist.ucsd.edu. Um, I really love my project. I love everyone who I work with and I think it's just one step closer to helping us all just love science and